Hi everyone, here we are again in Sandra and Steve Love How to Strike talk show. This morning we're going to talk about something really very interesting for everyone and probably this may not be applicable to uh, everyone across the board but if you're living in the UK like Steve, middle class, not really the wealthy level uh, type of people with stroke and you have an outstanding mortgage, this is something for you because definitely we're going to talk about definitely. changes in the law if you have a mortgage following your stroke. So stay tuned. So tell us, Steve, about your experience. I understand you received a letter from, uh, was it HMRC? Yeah, the government, the government, yeah. The government, the, yeah. The job, uh, job, job seekers. Yeah. Uh, job seekers uh, yeah. thing, you know. Yeah, this is something, it's yeah. called the Mortgage Support mm. Interest Loan. Okay, Mortgage. So M MSI Loan. Mortgage Support, support interest, interest Loan. loan. Okay. okay, tell us about this, Steve. Well, it is, right. You got, when, when you've had a stroke, obviously, some people can go back to work, some people can't. At mm. the minute, I can't go back to work. Okay. Right? Mm -hmm. So I'll get a little bit of help. Not much help. I'll pay three quarters of the mortgage myself, Sandro. Okay. But the government job seekers pay a quarter. Mm -hmm. Right? I think it's about a week. Right? Mm -hmm. So now the change in law from April the 6th mm -hmm. of next year, mm -hmm. right? You have to take out a mortgage support interest loan. Mortgage support interest loan. So explain us uh, what yeah. is this? Talk us through this. It's um, yeah. it's saying that based on what left, what's left in your mortgage, and they, and you right. If you say if you get help, say if we call it like mm. fifty pound a week, mm. right? So that's two hundred pound a month. Mm. When you come to sell your house, mm. you have to repay plus interest mm. all the loan what you got back. You got. Mm. So say if you, if you borrowed over the, over fifteen years, twenty thousand pound. Mm. You have to pay, when you sell your house mm -hmm. or downsize, and you got your profit in your house. Mm -hmm. You have to pay them back twenty thousand oh, pounds. Okay. As before, yeah. they just wrote it off, didn't they? Mm -hmm. But I want, mm -hmm. what I want to know. I could have played when I first had my stroke. I could have sold my house, right, mm -hmm. and rented one. Mm -hmm. and the government would have paid that, and they're still going to carry on paying it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So mm -hmm. you know, it I think uh, it's disadvantageous if you have a house or if yeah. you have a mortgage. But let's say you're renting. So you're saying, Steve, if you're renting, you're better off, you know? Oh, yeah, I'll say you are. The arrangement yeah. is better because they will pay your rent anyway. The bloke who gave me a phone yeah. on Monday from the the government, the government, the job seekers allowance, or whoever it is, Sandro, mm -hmm. they've employed a, a third party to do or do oh, all, To deal with this uh, deal, To deal with. So issue. they yeah. uh, they, deal, they gave me a phone mm -hmm. on Monday, and I asked them that question. I said, um, what happens if I sell my house? If I struggle and I sell my house, mm -hmm. um, mm -hmm. who pays for me rent? Mm -hmm. Oh, sorry. Um, I'm not. I'm not advised to. I don't mm. really know that question. Mm. I thought you know he didn't know, Sandro. Mm. Yeah. I think. I think because when you're renting, Steve, the house will not really going to be ultimately yours, is it? You know. But no. when you when you have a mortgage, you have a, a mortgage uh, to to the house. You know, and uh, the government will pay your mortgage. Yeah. Well, and pay... Eventually, the house will be yours. So yeah. I think they. Uh, uh, what, what they think is. Uh, we should have a share of that house because we're paying for the, the house. You know, the let's only, say uh, interest only, uh, uh, whatever they're paying, interest yeah. only. Normally, it's on, interest only, isn't it? And say mm. if the, if your mortgage rate goes down, they pay less. Mm. You know, they pay it gets re recalculated and yeah, they pay less. The government is paying interest only for yeah. the mortgage. Yeah. Thing. They don't really pay the principal. No. So, but uh, over the long term, over the years that they're doing this for you. Eventually, your property will have equity. You know, will have yeah. positive equity, assuming there is a positive equity. You know, yeah, but so they want uh, maybe a share of that positive equity. Well, well, I think that's what they're saying, Steve. You uh, know? The, I think what it is, they're just trying to yeah. get money off the. Well, my personal opinion, mm. get money. People can't work, Sandra. There's people like worse than me mm. in wheelchairs, mm. disabled, and they're and they're screaming and saving. And now that this has come over them, you know what I mean? Mm. They have to pay back the money, but. Yeah. The only the only loophole in, in mm. it there's a little mm. tiny mm. loophole, mm. right? Say if I had a house mm. and I never sell it, mm. I don't have to pay back the money. Mm. So say if I if I'm if I'm sixty five, mm. mm. right, mm. and I and I just want to live in my house till mm. I pass away, mm. I don't have to pay back the loan. Mm. Well, let's say Steve, you have a, a, a son or a daughter, you yeah. know, that you want the house to be given to, you know, as an yeah. inher inheritance, you know. Yeah. Uh, let's say uh, half of the mortgage, you know, or half of the time or life of the mortgage uh, were paid by uh, the government because you yeah. had a stroke and you died, you know. Not uh, your Will your son or your daughter get any inheritance from the house, you know, from oh. the property? Or I'll say that. How, how do they uh, I'll uh, say once, go once I, I would say they have to pay back the money, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. as long as you, they, you, you pay back the money. You yeah, know, from, yeah. Uh, you know, uh, but them. The, 
But what, the, yeah. what they're trying to say is, right, you can pay back the loan any time you want. Say, when, when mm. my house mm. gets paid off for in mm. another few years' time, so my mortgage is paid off, I still don't have to pay the interest back, mm. the mm. loan off. Mm. Do you know when my mortgage is paid mm. off? Mm. So I've got all the money I'm paying now towards my mm. mortgage. Mm. I can pay that mm. towards my loan. Mm. So, so let's say, Steve, you know, uh, uh, we look at this uh, situation from a different perspective. Let's say, uh, uh, you know, all of a sudden you've decided to uh, sell your house, you know. Yeah. So you, you uh, get the money, you know, the, the equity of the property so, yeah. so that you can spend it, you know. Yeah, I'll, have to pay, I'll still have to pay yeah. them back. So you, you pay them back, yeah. Yeah, there's, there's, there's three. They're, yeah. they're saying, so, I'll, I'll, actually on the leaflet that they sent mm -hmm. me, there's three ways you can do it. Sell your house mm -hmm. and downsize. Mm -hmm. So you... You done the pay. You say so your mortgage is going to be a lot, lot less, so you might be able to cover it. Mm. Get family or friends to pay the interest. Mm. Imagine me going to my sister mm. or, or family member mm. saying, mm. Mm. "Will you pay me me, me, me interest?" No one's mm. going to do that, are they? Unless mm. they're multi-millionaires. Mm. Or the third thing is what you can do is get the mortgage support interest loan. Mm. Well, let's mm. say you, you you've chosen uh, whichever is uh, uh, more advantageous to you, and yeah. and uh, you, your your house has been sold already. Yeah, and now you live in the rented property. Will the government pay your rent? Yeah. Really? Yeah. So you might as well sell your house. Yeah, but yeah, 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 yeah. yeah I know what you mean. I'll, if mm -hmm. I'm going to sell my house, I'm going to have to sell it now, aren't I? Yeah, yeah. You yeah. might as well sell your house and then uh, move to a rented property and then <laughs> tell the government to pay it. What do you think? Yeah, I'm just trying to think. You, <laughs> that's, a good, that's, that's a good question. Though. But I say, the, the main booklet, yeah. it's been sent to me. Mm -hmm. So I've got, you got until April 6th to, um, this is a good conversation, right? I'm a bit naive to it, mm, mm. or we're talking about it, but mm. people watching this, Sandra, might know a lot more about it. Get in contact with me, spread it all on, on the internet. Let's see what, what the yeah. loopholes are. Let's mm. see let's see what we can do, Sandra. Yeah, As I yeah. say, if I, if mm. I, I, if I can say to them, right, I can pay my own, own mm. in, in, in interest, mm. can I, mm. right, for about a month. Mm. And then during that month, I can sell my house. Because mm. mm. they, they ain't helping me, are they? Yeah, yeah. Right, so I can pay my own, so we're a week, mm. right? Mm. For a month, I can afford that, mm. and then in that month time, I can sell my house and get all the mm. profit, mm. and then go into rented mm. accommodation. Mm. Yeah, there must yeah. be some loopholes. Eventually, Steve, it really makes sense to sell your house anyway because you want to unlock the money you yeah, store in yeah, the house, yeah, you know. Because your, your life is not very long, Steve. You know, uh, twenty years time, I, I doubt if you can do anything what you're doing now. You know, so yeah, you might as well unlock those uh, money got, and got, then spend it and enjoy it. I've got nine years left, actually, on my mortgage. Mm. Nine years, so I'll be. Well, people watching the video now, I just, I just had my 50th birthday. So I'll be 59, sell my house, mm. right? This is what I could do. Mm. Sell my house at 59, mm. right? Pay back then five grand or whatever I'm going to owe them. Mm. And then the rest, um, I'm mm. going, to, then I'm going to spend a few quid going to rent accommodation, don't I? Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> but I don't know, I'm really, yeah. I'm, yeah, I don't know how that works, Sanjay. Yeah, so, I think so, you, you have to do some uh, calculations as well. As well as you, you think as well, you know, uh, in nine years time, uh, would you would you still think you'll be uh, capable enough to do the things you think you can do at the moment? You know, well, you don't know like like, like me, Steve. You know, yeah. I, I am forty-seven. Now, let's say uh, uh, fifteen years from now. Yeah. I, I doubt if I can still do the things I'm enjoying now. Like I'm skiing, you know, I'm learning to kite surf. You know, be, you know. you, you might be. I, I, I doubt it, you know. So I might as well do it now while I can yeah, do it. Yeah, you know? yeah definitely. I'll, I'll, yeah, I'll same as you, it. Steve. You know, but you I can say, travel, you can drive, you know. Yeah, but I've got right. The mortgage, right? Mm -hmm. The last ten years, obviously you're paying off a lot more, aren't you? Mm -hmm. So my mortgage now, it's all paying off. The money I pay every every month now, mm -hmm. it's knocking a lot off the um, the mortgage. Mm -hmm. The first fifteen years, you you're paying the interest and all that, but now mm -hmm. these nine years mm -hmm. are the most important bit. So mm -hmm. if I sell my house now, I won't get hardly. Uh, you know, it's not worth selling it. But if I sell it in nine years' time when it's paid off. Mm -hmm. You're better I'm, off. I've got. I'm, oh yeah, yeah. If, if that's the case, Steve. Then yeah. uh, uh, what nine years? The last, you know? the last yeah. nine years of your mortgage, yeah. you actually, you you can see chunks. You know, when you get your mortgage, um, your mm. enforce every year, you think oh, I ain't paid a lot off compared to last year. You think mm. no, but this mm. is nine. Like, last nine mm. years, you are paying mm. off a lot. Mm. Mm. I owe about mm. my house. Mm. And, yeah. and in nine years' time, uh, like, well, you you settle that balance completely. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, so, that's good. So. Yeah. And uh, in your in your own calculation, you're better off uh, completing uh, the remainder of the nine years. I think so. Paying yeah. it off completely and then uh, selling the house. Because what know? happens as well, Sandra? If you pay early, you get you get um, points took off, money took off, don't you? Yeah. If you yeah. set up your mortgage early, then I then think it depends as well, oh. Steve, uh, uh, on the current uh, 
uh, property market scenario. You know, let's say uh, nine years from now there's a crash in the property market. Yeah. And then uh, you probably lose money. Yeah. yeah. And let's say now uh, is the best time to sell your house because uh, prices are high. You know, your uh, like uh, you call that the buyer. Uh, I mean, uh, uh, seller's time. You yeah. know, like. Uh, advantages for people selling houses you, did, did that, you think so it depends it depends on the situation Steve yeah. you know let's say uh, right now is the time to sell yeah you make more money and the future anyway you don't know what will happen in the future that's, that's yeah, yeah, yeah. You, you might as well uh, sell it <laughs> so I'll tell you what you, you, <laughs> and, and you, lack no money you know what you say 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 yeah, say, yeah right you know if I mm. if, if it wasn't for the thing like mm. pound mm. right left of my house nine years is, is a long time mm. I, I know you mean well i think nine years ago right what was like this what things i do nine years mm. ago suppose mm. what i do now mm. obviously the mm. change I've had, I've had problems with stroke and all that but nine years time it's a gamble life's a gamble isn't it yeah it's a gamble yeah you know, i could sell my house tomorrow yeah and mm. then nine years time look back on it i think my house would have been mm. worth double that instead of me yeah, yeah. me going around the world on but a little I think, cruise. I think uh, uh, the best question to ask Steve is is uh, the time is is time uh, uh, on your side? You know, that's a song. That uh, is, uh, uh, if you're young, you know, it makes sense to really yeah. save. You say, know, but we're, we're if you're not to... young anymore, I don't yeah. think it makes sense to save a lot of money. You know, you might as well spend oh, your no. money because you won't have time to uh, to go, spend it. You know, go back to like the 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 uh, mortgage support interest loan mm. at the minute. I'm paying a lot of money a month, a week, mm. a month to my mortgage. I'm paying out me, mm. me savings and all that. Mm. So my savings every month, Sandra, mm. are going down slightly. Mm. You, you know what I mean? Mm. So, you know what I mean? I've had to stop doing things. Mm. But, you know what I mean? But if you can unlock the money you have in your house, you know, then this is a lot of money that yeah. you can enjoy, you know, for, you know, many years, you know. Uh, yeah, instead of seeing this rain, Sandra, we, yeah. can, we can be in the sun. <laughs> But so like I, I think uh, uh, we'll leave it like that, Steve. Yeah, you know, yeah. Uh, uh, if people out there, you have some comments. Hopefully, of, uh, don't forget it's called mortgage yeah. support interest loan. Yeah, right. Spread yeah. the world word, word mm. right. Get back to us. Let us know. A question. Sandro put a little thing down here. What it's called? Yeah. Mortgage support interest loan. And if you can find loan. a link, you know, we'll post it here. You know, yeah. a link to this. Uh, Starts uh, April, uh, early April of next year. Mm. For yeah. for you know the government stuff. Thank, so thank you. Very you. Much. Thank you very much for listening. And hopefully, we we'll see you again next time. Bye bye. Bye.